Ladies and gentlemen, live on Iliad, we are real fake media, and we're an international household name. I'm your man's Digger Dame Lee, a.k.a. Poppy Razzi. You know, the guy with the bionic guy. Check it out. I just got a call, and uh, I was informed there's a new film project coming out by Pashworks, and it's called... What I Tell My Kids, it's a documentary film, right? And so as I look at some of my notes here, I want to run across a couple things. If you have children, or you find yourself around children, although you may not have given birth to them, what is it that you're telling them? And this is all in a range of, let's say, from the Obama administration all the way down to this new guy they call the Trumpy guy, the Donald Trump dude. What is it that you're telling your youth about today's world and how to navigate in it, considering there was a point in history where information was, was held from you, now you're being bombarded with so much information, you can't even properly think for yourselves. So what is it exactly that you tell your children? What is it that you tell your kids? So this documentary says here, we're going to try to capture the audience of today's youth, right? We want to try to... Communicate with them with their style of communication, rather it's through the technology, rather it's through the form of music, and or audiovisual language that they're digesting on a day-to-day -day basis. Uh, the film's concept embraces what um, transpires in our country as of late, while depicting historical timelines highlighting choices made from all these different perspectives. So our goal is to offer without bias the next generation of parents and leaders an opportunity to reflect on specific choices made by those in position of authority who are influencing the young minds today. Now I'm not plagiarizing, I'm just aiming to be exact in my articulation with this information that was sent to me. But I want y'all to really pay attention to this because you got to understand we have the concept of what we call government. We have the concept of what we call law. We have the concept of what we call teachers. And then we're dealing with the concept that we call parents. And these four calibrations of energy are dictating how the youth are seeing and participating in the information that's being given to them. So I want to know what do you tell your kids in certain situations, rather it's about gang violence, homosexuality, promiscuity, all different types of things, the usage of paraphernalia, um, drugs, the, the needles, the heroin overdose that we seem to be running into again. And this is the 2000 something gnosis right now. This ain't the 1900s. This is the 2000 something gnosis. So we want to know what is it that you're telling your kids? How fair is this to them? Um, we want to provide the youth with the proper awareness, man, and, and guide them into a space of making better decisions for themselves because, as we know, we were raised by people that were farmed. So we kind of cheat ourselves and our youth when we communicate with them. And the way they communicate outside our guidance is not the language that we're using. So I want to know, what do you tell your kids? You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going to come back and say some more things, but I just wanted to get this out right now. I want to know, what are you telling the youth? Are you really trying to help them? You're trying to hold them back? You're trying to make them feel bad about what you don't know versus what they do know? Things of these have to be answered. We have to answer these things. You understand? So y'all stay with us. We live with Iliad. I'm going to look at what I just did. Then when I come back, I'm going to do it for real. Ha, 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 ha. Welcome to the future, baby.